Now we've got two thumbs up. Drivers behind the lines in three, two, one, go. We are pushing onward and upward. It's 51, 67 machine guns. Some of those power cells into the top shelf. Their partner 24, 51 doing the same. Oh, cow. And don't look now. That Red Alliance leads 61 to 31. Talk about some bangers. So this Blue Alliance is looking to respond in kind. Electro Eagles got a good gaggle of, of power cells in their robot. They shotgun blast a few out. One goes in. But 5167 with another volley sends a few up top. Oh, gosh. 7660 looks to nearly take my head off. And that Vibot team from Marysville continues to make it rain at the top shelf. Five in a row. It's just a beauty. Chef's kiss, you know? 56-12 on this blue alliance is edging towards that loading zone. While the Electro Eagles put in one, two, three into that blue alliance upper goal. 51 doing the same. And 24-51 with another four in the top shelf. Red leads 95 to 54 with 50 seconds left in the match. Now, one trouble spot is those Vibots do have one of their hooks, maybe their only hook, dangling on the ground, which means they might not be able to score points by hanging on the shield which robots are wont to do at this time in the match. We see 24-51 climbing. Giving a nice little stretch for the bar. But can they deliver? They're up and off. Blue, 51, Wings of Fire coming in to do the same. With three, two, one, zero. Alrighty, let's take a look at our score. Uh, the Red Alliance wins. 152 to 83. With 24-51 staying in that third place position.